In this video, I'm going to show you how to get potato graphics in Fortnite on AMD GPU. Basically, how to make your game look super low quality, but run extremely smooth. Perfect if you're struggling with low FPS, lag, or stutters on your PC. Now, before we jump into the tutorial, let me quickly explain what potato graphics actually means. So, potato graphics is a fun way of saying ultra-low graphics settings. When you enable potato graphics, the game removes or reduces almost all visual effects, like shadows, high-quality textures, reflections, foliage, and anti-aliasing. It basically makes Fortnite look like an old mobile game, but in return, you'll get much higher FPS and smoother gameplay especially on low-end PCs or laptops. This is super helpful if you've got a weaker AMD GPU and want to focus purely on performance. Then this video is for you. Now, let's make your game ultra smooth and ultra low graphics. Now first, we'll adjust Fortnite in-game settings. So go into settings. Now, first, set display mode to full screen. Full screen gives the best performance and lowest input delay. Borderless or windowed mode can cause stutters and lower FPS because Windows keeps rendering your desktop in the background. Next, set resolution to 1920 by 1080. Lowering resolution reduces the number of pixels your GPU has to render. This massively improves FPS, especially on low-end GPUs. If you want even higher FPS, you can go down to 1280 by 720. Then, set frame rate limit to match your monitor, like 60, 120, or 144 FPS. Capping FPS keeps your GPU stable and prevents overheating or stuttering from frame spikes. Set rendering mode to DirectX 11. DirectX 11 is the most stable for AMD GPUs. DX12 and performance mode can sometimes cause crashes or stutters. Now, set 3D resolution to 40% or 50%. This is the main potato setting. It lowers the internal render quality. Your game will look blurrier, but FPS will skyrocket. Perfect for squeezing every bit of performance out of your AMD GPU. Change view distance to near. This limits how far the game renders buildings and players. It slightly reduces visibility, but gives a nice FPS boost. Turn shadows off. Shadows are one of the most demanding graphics options in Fortnite. Disabling them instantly improves FPS and makes the game smoother. Turn motion blur off. Motion blur makes the image look smoother during movement, but hides stutters. It's better to keep it off for clear visuals and low input lag. Now, once you set in-game settings, now we'll make Fortnite go even lower than the in-game settings allow. Close Fortnite completely. Press Windows plus R and type percent local app data percent and press enter. Then go to Fortnite game folder, then save, config, and then Windows client. Open the file called game user settings in notepad. Now scroll down and change these lines. View distance quality equals zero. Shading quality equals zero, anti-aliasing quality equals zero, textures quality equals zero, effects quality equals zero, post-process quality equals zero. Setting everything to zero forces Fortnite to use its lowest possible visual quality, even lower than the settings menu allows. This gives you the real potato graphics look and maximum FPS. Then also make sure these lines are correct. B use vsync equals false. B show grass equals false. B show FPS equals true. After editing, click save, close notepad, right click the file, Choose Properties, and check Read Only. This prevents Fortnite from automatically changing your settings back. Now let's tweak AMD Adrenaline settings for better FPS and lower lag. Open AMD Adrenaline software. Go to the Gaming tab, find Fortnite. Now, change these options. Radeon Anti-Lag on for reducing input delay, making your game feel more responsive. Radeon Chill off. Chill limits FPS to save power. You don't want that. It can cause lag spikes. Radeon Boost on automatically lowers resolution while you move, improving FPS directly during fast gameplay. Image sharpening, set to 5 to 10%, adds sharpness to low-res visuals, helps if your game looks too blurry after using potato settings. Anisotropic filtering, override, set to 2x, slightly improves texture quality without much performance loss. Texture filtering quality, set to performance, focuses GPU on speed instead of visuals. Wait for vertical refresh, always off, prevents input lag and keeps frame timing stable. After all these steps, launch Fortnite again. You'll notice the graphics look super basic, but your FPS will be much higher. Your input delay will drop, and the game will feel much smoother. That's the power of potato graphics on AMD GPUs.